Hi guys, today in this video, I will be making a 2-in-1 auto cut off charging controller with battery level indicator. For this circuit, you need following components. A 12 volt relay. 1.5, 33 and 56 kilo ohms resistors. 2 pieces 1 and 4 007 diodes. 470 to 1000 UF capacitor. 100 NF tantalum capacitor. BC 557 PNP transistor. 10K and 100K multi-turn potentiometers, some red, green and blue LEDs, 4-pin terminal connector, and brain of this project, LM3914IC, with IC holder. I also prepared the circuit diagram for this project, where I used LM3914IC to indicate battery charging levels from 10 to 100%, and on reaching 100%, it will automatically cut off charging to battery through this transistor. And this connector works as a switch, which remains on, until battery charging reaches to 100%, then it turns off. So, you can use one line of both DC, or AC of the charger for cutoff switching. For easy assembly of the circuit, I designed the PCB for this project. And the PCB is going to be look like this. You can download both circuit diagram and PCB files, link is in video description. In order to manufacture this PCB, visit jlcpcb.com. And here you can add the Gerber file I provided. After uploading, you can see the preview of the PCB. You can also change quantity and the color of PCBs as per your requirements. And then save to cart for checkout. Within some days I got my order from JLCPCB delivered. And the quality of the PCBs is amazing, and 5 pieces is for just $2. Now it is time to assemble the PCB. So, let's place all the components on the PCB according to the circuit diagram. And after spending some time with the soldering process, I cleaned the PCB with isopropyl alcohol. And here our PCB is looking nice and clean. Now let's place the IC into the base holder. Connect the DC wires into this connector. Before connecting to DC, set both potentiometers to maximum limit. Now I will connect multimeter to keep track of voltage. Also connect variable power supply to calibrate the circuit for the battery. I will set lowest voltage to 11.7 volts where it will indicate battery is low. Now, use the screwdriver and rotate the second potentiometer anti-clockwise till the last red LED turns off. So the lowest point is set. Now set the cut off voltage, where battery level should also read as 100%. Just set it to 13.8 volts, you can set it by your choice. Now use screwdriver, and rotate first potentiometer anti-clockwise till green LED turns on. Then rotate slowly to clockwise, till blue LED turns on. So the cut off voltage is also set. Now let's try to test the circuit by decreasing voltage. You can see, on decreasing voltage to 12 volts, it will show 10% charge left. And then below, last LED also turns off, indicating battery is at 0%. Now, on increasing voltage back to 12 volts, it will indicate 10%. And on increasing voltage to further, it will indicate higher different percentages. And on reaching to 13.8 volts, blue LED will turn on, indicating 100% charge, and at the same time cut off will disconnect charging to battery. As discussed earlier, this connector works as charger switch. It remains on, until battery charging reaches to 100%, it turns off the charger. Here I interfaced this light with the circuit, the negative of this light is directly connected with negative. And the positive is connected between the switch. So, when the battery level is low, it will turn on charging.
and when the battery level reaches 200%, it will immediately turn off charging at the cutoff voltage set by you. Also, you can use this connector to show battery levels as graph or dot mode. But the preferred mode should be dot mode because it consumes less power for indicating battery levels. So, for today, that is it. If you enjoyed the video, give a thumbs up. For more useful videos, subscribe the channel. Also, check out these recommended videos. Thanks for watching.